Hey everyone, it's time for more Star Trek Online, and uh, well, Murray Duck's here. He uh, he managed to get apparently get all his stuff fixed. So uh, yes, I did. <laughs> so yeah, greetings, viewers and subscribers, and everyone will like welcome back. <laughs> <laughs> yep. And for this, since I skipped over since I skipped over the uh, Romulan deal, we're gonna be doing I'm gonna be doing one in this batch and one in the next batch because I accidentally skipped over skipped over those <laughs> last time uh for yep, this one like a dummy for this one we'll be doing smash and grab you wanna you wanna read this or should should i <clears throat> i know you're looking for tovin's sister rinna i've managed to find out some more information about her she was captured in the Fevan system she's been questioned by the Tashiar, and now they're moving her and other prisoners to a penal colony deep in romulan space They'll be using civilian transports, lightly guarded by a few Romulan Star Empire ships. She'll be on the transport passing through the King Kuthanza system. If you don't go now, you'll never see her again. I'm risking my position to tell you this, Centurion. Don't make me regret my decision. Yeah, I wasn't I wasn't entirely sure how to pronounce this system. I'm glad you did, because I had no idea how to do that. Big Yeah. Right. And over here, and let's begin. Yeah, I hit the, <laughs> I hit the deal, then it just flew me by the, uh, flew me by the star. Mhm. Mm see if I can. There we go. We've located the transports that are carrying the prisoners. And Charva's intel isn't exactly accurate. She told us they were going to be tall Shi'ar ships, but they're Cardassian. Do you think they could be disguised? Yeah, I forgot that. I forgot that he uh, that he talks for you. And lightly guarded, they have combat-ready escorts. We'll need to defeat the escorts and disable the transport vessels. Then we can board and start looking for my sister. I still think she could be on board, even though the escorts are Cardassian ships instead of tall Shi'ar. Right, so we cloak, fly in, and attack all the Tailshar ships. Let me turn that down just a little bit. Oh, it's kind of loud. Oh, that's Of course, the transports are not going to be too much of a problem. Everything else is, though. I do like one thing that they did with uh, the bridge officer's space abilities. You no longer have to put any skill points into them. They already start out max level. Yeah, that's a that's quite nice. Yeah, that was actually kind of annoying. I won't lie. Yep. I mean, it's a change I very much approve of. Although, as far as the uh, the class specific kits go for like ground stuff. Um well I suppose it's great to have multiple options like swapping out one kit component. Like uh for, for, for instance, I'm a science officer of course. So I imagine I've got medical stuff and science stuff. I can swap out uh say I've got a kit with two science and one medical, so I can swap out the medical part easily, or I could just have the uh, food science and that have them uh, just interchange at any point. I kind of do like that customization, although when I first saw it, I was like, it, it just took the event to get used to it. That takes care of, takes care of him. Of course, now we got this, now we got this galore to take care of. Somebody's shooting me from the, from behind. What is it? Oh, it's one of those. Uh, that would be the transports. Yeah, the transports themselves are in fact armed, but they're not they're not as armed as the uh, Galore's the other ships. They're shooting you with a Tetrion. Oops. 
You got a lot of torpedoes going on there. That's the benefits of torpedo and high yield too. Boom. And of course, naturally we naturally, you know, can't have can't have a space fight without reinforcements. And I got my boat. Let's swing around so I don't take any more hold of it. Thought that was a uh thought that was a uh no, I'm trying to remember. Warp plasma there for a second. No, he's just a big freaking. Science team, boom! Heavy plasma torpedo. Yeah, boom. I don't even think that can only got a chance to do the whole uh, shield distribution and shield battery. Yep. One thing I actually have noticed about the Kelvins is that after they do that, they don't seem to spawn their photonic lords anymore. I don't know why. Yeah, I would, yeah, the, the, the photonic lords were always a bit annoying because, but then of course, I guess that's why they were there just to be annoying. <laughs> Too bad these weren't Romulan ships because I always appreciate the nice uh, wormhole. That's the last of them. And away team is waiting in the yep, transport. The nice singularity in the first transport as soon as you're ready. Right. <clears throat> yeah, and the um, um Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, and the enemies oops. Alright. There's something blocking our scanners, which would which would be the standard operating procedure for a vessel carrying prisoners. We need to search the ship and then head to the bridge. I'm actually kind of surprised he didn't say anything there because that was because usually he's the one always talking. Uh oh. Also, if my mic sounds a little bit quiet, there's really not much I can do about it. My my voice transmit volume on Steam is at maximum, and no, that's fine. Considering I'm using a laptop and the built-in mic, there's yeah, there's just really not that much there I can do about it. There are faint life signs up ahead. One of them could be Rena. Let's that's check fine. Fire. I can actually, I can actually. Oh, I don't think. Yeah, we're not supposed to go down here. Well, that guy was completely that guy was completely boned. Shooting him and then then vaporizing him. Oh, here come here comes some more. Okay, you're you're in there, so I'm going to go. explosives. Some shield units. Nope, not aboard, not aboard this ship. So now we got to, we got to go to the bridge. Oh, I like how the old door override button is also a tactical thing. Yep. I mean that doesn't really make much sense to me. I mean, the option's already there. Why make it a career specific thing? <laughs> I have no idea. That is. Yeah, that is kind of weird. Although I think, if I remember correctly, I think if you override the door, it's a tactical, the door blows up. Don't quote me on that. Yeah, though. that's a, uh, I just noticed that when I did that. It, it just uh, blew up. That might be why, because, uh, oh, the, this document appears to be stolen. It describes Tal Shiar movements in the sector. Perhaps the Tal Shiar knew the Cardassians took this convoy and sent us here to fight them. No matter who survived, us or the true way, either way, the Tall Shi'ar wins. Yep, that's how the Tall Shi'ar work. The Tall Shi'ar led us into a trap, again. I'm tired of being lied to, being that's tricked. right there. The self-destruct on the ship is still active. Let's set it before we beam over to the next one. 
So if you're ready to transport to the next vessel, we can move the away team directly to that ship's bridge. That might save you some time. Ooh, we're gonna get we're gonna go right to the bridge. And not too surprising, first thing that happens is a fight. And that guy just kind of got vaporized. That guy was just kind of standing there and let me shoot him in the back for a little bit. There isn't any data on prisoners here. It's just cargo and soldiers. I don't understand why Charva would send us here. Was she trying to get us killed? I saw your Toven in that cutscene as well as mine. Oops. Oh well. Do we need your to go ship down. Is to be part of the convoy being sent to the Pycana sector block, which doesn't exist anymore because sector space is pretty much just wide open. Range. Yep. Yep. They removed the. Uh, they your remo orders are to ambush any Romulan ships that you can overwhelm easily and acquire their cloaking technology. Oh, okay. You are you are accessing the uh, things here. <laughs> I was wondering what yeah, you were reading there. <laughs> Self-destruct sequence, and uh, we have to manually overload the warp core now. And of course, never. Oh, never move out of the way. Yeah. That's fine. I got knocked down, but I did indeed get back up again. Yes. <laughs> Sorry, I had to say it. That's fine. Yeah. All right. It almost looks like you go into that room since uh, it seems to have an area, but no, door is. Yeah, sometimes uh, there, sometimes so they'll be a little bit sneaky. Do we need to go down? Because oh, I guess so. Let's yeah, let's not get knocked down again. That would be that would be annoying. God, I love my plasma piercing being right full. I'm still wearing my I'm still wearing my uh my winter clothes. I need to change that next time. <laughs> I actually I actually was good planning on doing that, but I just kind of forgot. Neither of us are an engineer. Nope. If one of us was an engineer, it would just be able to do that. So now we need to destroy the warp core modules. Blowing shit up? I could do that. And of course, right. beam out to the last deal. To the next ship. Yeah, I forgot. I forgot about changing out of my winter deals. I definitely need to do that before the art, before the next batch of things. Sir, I'm detecting an energy build up ahead of us in what appears to be another cargo hold. Recommend we investigate before we head to the bridge. So we need to investigate. There's a. Yeah, there's. There's Cardassians here that we need to take care of. Look at all these warheads. Yep, that's a lot of that's a lot of bombs. Well, explosives, either way. Torpedoes. Ooh. I'm, yep, that's you. Here's your my science. science thing. Smoke screen. Yep. You blinded them with science. <laughs> oh, I couldn't help. I could, me with science. Yeah, I couldn't help doing that one either. <laughs> It just kind of, oh, just kind of fit. I can't remember the last time I saw that particular progressive commercial, but oh my god, that was great. Right. And of course, we shoot them all anyway because yep. we're douchebags. <laughs> yep. <like> that. <laughs> well, that that may <laughs> drop items anyway, so. Yeah, and we like stuff. Yep, we like we like our stuff. And look at this, even more. Even more warheads. You guys want to throw grenades? Well, that's fine. I can throw my own. I can throw my own grenades. So, yeah, I don't want to walk into the plasma fire though. That would be kind of bad. Of course, this guy is a bit tougher, a bit more higher ranked than your typical Cardassian. Oh, crap. But he's still dead, anyways. Uh, I'm guessing it's probably going to trigger a, trigger a thing. Yep. It's a trap! 
The shift is rigged with a uh, to self-destruct. Initiating emergency transport. Uh oh. Uh oh, his steam just his steam just died on me. <laughs> on us. Let's see if I can let's see if I can do, 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 do. Okay. Okay, let's... Yeah, hopefully you guys aren't hearing the telephone. We're having a little bit of technical issues here. Okay, sounds like... Sounds like I'm going to be doing the rest of this on my own. Well, sort of. He's still there, but the call... The call, as you can probably tell, is, well, in the... We'll be able to, we'll be able to finish the mission, no doubt, but, but, uh, yeah, you're not going to be able to hear it. Like that, get some more shields up, and boom. I provided the convoy's coordinates as a gesture of good faith. I remember how close Tovin and his Tovin was to his sister. Rihanna was my friend too. Although she committed crimes against the Romulan Star Empire, I'm willing to give her and you another chance. Hold on a second. No, unfortunately it looks like Steam's being a bit wonky, so How could you lie to us again? Lead us into another trap. And you use Rena to do it. That's low. Even for the Tal Shiar. She wasn't on those transports. It was all a setup. A deception intended to get us killed. And I'm not falling for it again. Give me a reason. Any reason to believe the woman I cared about is still in you. That you can still be safe. Whoops. Yep, we should report back to the sub-commander, sub-commander Nahal. We need to put word out that the convoy was successfully destroyed, but that Rihanna is still missing. As to what Charva is playing, as to what game Charva is playing, that will take more time to understand. I'm ready to go, ready to get out there. We can leave the system whenever you're ready. I'm not entirely sure what happened to what happened with the chat girl there. That was kind of weird. Right. Bring up the journal and smash and grab. Yep, we put word out that Tovin's sister is still missing. I'll let you know if we hear anything. Keep talking to Charva. It's clear now that she's playing some sort of game. But but we can get ahead of this if you and Tovin keep her distracted. Anything that will give us an upper hand with the Tal Shiar will help our cause. Uh Yeah, I want I want that. Congratulations, Centurion. And uh there we go. We ranked up and the mission is over. Hopefully next time I do hopefully next time I do a deal with uh, with Murray Duck, Steam will be a bit more cooperative. But that'll be for next time. Later.